Why do dermatologists consider glycerin the unsung hero of skincare? Hi, I'm Dr. Jackie Levin, the Ingredient Derm. Let's explore evidence-based facts about glycerin so you can make an informed decision about what's right or wrong for your skin. Let's talk about glycerin. Did you actually know it's a natural part of your skin? Yes, your body makes it. When it comes to using glycerin in products, here's what you need to know. Number one, concentration is crucial. You'll find it in products anywhere from two to 40%. And while a little is good and a little more is better, anything over 40% can actually dehydrate the skin. Number two, source is critical. If you're vegan, you may wanna look for vegetable-derived glycerin that usually comes from coconut or soy. If you're worried about sustainability, you may wanna avoid palm-derived glycerin. And finally, if you're worried about carcinogenic impurities, never use glycerin from the Jetrofa plant. And number three, in terms of its safety profile, it's likely pregnancy safe, it's non-carcinogenic and non-allergenic and non-toxic, but in terms of its safety profile, the source is gonna determine its safety. Ready to learn about glycerin's powerful skin benefits? Stay tuned for our next video. Save this post and drop a comment if you're looking at your product right now, determine if the source of glycerin is listed.